With great joy, I extend a cordial welcome to the members of Ligatus. You have come to Rome in order to renew your determination to apply the teachings of Christ and his church to the business world. Its name is the Latin word for ambassador, but the members of Legatus are really ambassadors for Christ in the field of business. Legatus has inspired Catholic businessmen and women to extend the hand of friendship and faith to all they meet. Our nation depends on courageous leaders who will not only do things right, but do the right thing. We need business leaders who will not only make a profit, but make a difference. The purpose of a member is to, is to study the faith, live the faith, and spread the faith. Those are the big three, and, the, and that's a good foundation to, uh, to build a Catholic life on. And Tom Monahan believes strongly in this faith-based organization he created in 1987 at the age of 50. At the time, he was one of America's most successful CEOs, growing Domino's Pizza from one store in a small college town to over 5,000 locations around the world. He had even bought the team of his boyhood dreams, the Detroit Tigers, and watched them win the World Series. But financial success was not something Tom found fulfilling. But I had to go through those things to, to realize what I already knew, that they're not important. But uh, uh, helping people get to heaven is vitally important, and that's what I'm trying to do now. And I think uh, uh, Legatus is a, a good example of that. An encounter between the world's most influential spiritual leader and this successful entrepreneur was the spark that ignited Legatus. Just hours after meeting Pope John Paul II at the Vatican in 1987, the inspiration for Legatus hit Tom Monahan like a lightning bolt. And so I immediately felt that that's uh, uh, a great idea of uh, the, uh, the Holy Spirit and uh, I never had a doubt from that moment on that this was something I was called to do. Today, Legatus is a worldwide organization of Catholic CEOs, business leaders and their spouses who have accepted the challenge of putting their faith to work in daily lives. Serving over 4,500 members in more than 75 chapters across the United States, Canada and around the world, Legatus encourages CEOs to be role models of Christian ethics in business, family, church, and community. Learning, living, and preaching, uh, I think is very important because I think God gives us a gift of our faith and we need to share it. We can't keep it underneath a rock. We need to share it to others. And so we do that at home with our, our family and our friends, but the element that was missing was at the workplace. The impact of uh, people who uh, practice their faith is is that it's uh, it has it can transform society and that's that's the whole point of Legatus I think is that we want to transform society and we are called uh, to do it in whatever forum God has called us to. Well, I say the purpose of Legatus is to uh, uh, help the church and uh, and I think Legatus can help in a big way because uh, uh, because uh, Presidents of uh, corporations are probably uh, among the most proven group of, uh, of leaders in the church. They didn't become uh, in that position uh, without a lot of talent and a lot of uh, uh, dedication. And they don't stay there if they don't have it. Every year, Legatus hosts a pilgrimage to Rome and two national conferences. 1998, Legatus made arrangements for us to attend a private audience with Pope John Paul II. And that was the highlight of my life, my husband's life. And it was the most beautiful and spiritual time. I just could not believe it. Pope John Paul stroked my cheek twice, held my hand, and spoke to me. And I walked away from there, and this man, this Pope, is a saint. And he's in my heart every day. Every month, Legatus chapters bring together Catholic business leaders and their spouses for Mass, Confession, and Rosary to help them grow in their faith. Mass is the most uh, 
uh, powerful prayer in the church. And, the, and to go to Mass together as a group, I thought, would be a very important part of the uh, community that we're trying to create with the Godless, uh, not only with other members, but with the, the spouses. The monthly chapter meeting continues with a cocktail hour, dinner, and a prominent speaker. For many members, these meetings not only deepen their relationship with God, but with their spouses as well. Legatus is, uh, is everything and more that we ever could have ever asked for. It's an opportunity to once again come closer to your faith, to revisit your faith, to have an increase in faith, to have a spiritual date with your wife, to have an opportunity for confession, rosary confession, and mass once a month, regardless of whatever else is going on in your busy life. I think it, 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 it helps ground us, uh, you know, uh, to the things that we, that we have and should consider to be most important and uh, uh, you know every time that we come here every every month uh, it's it's a kind of invigorating and it's a revitalizing evening talking about our faith learning about our faith is terrific and with new ideas we always come uh, leave the summit or even these meetings with new ideas and what to do and so much has to be done in the world right now. And I believe that we can set a good example and we can do more. Senator Mel Martinez, who is one of our early members, said that uh, Legatus uh, was a, a monthly date with his wife and their, and their marriage uh, grew stronger because of that uh, uh, spiritual experience that they, that they had together. And I think that can be said for many members. I think uh, probably in, in most cases the monthly chapter meeting is probably the most meaningful spiritual experiences that couples have with each other. Today success for Tom Monahan means spiritual growth and Legatus is his ultimate dream for inspiring business leaders to spread their faith. I think maybe uh, Legatus is probably the, the best idea I ever had. I'm spending most of my time now on uh, uh, building the but I hope to be a great Catholic university, Ave Maria University. But I'm not sure that as great as it becomes, uh, that it becomes the finest Catholic university in the world, which uh, uh, we're trying to do, that it could be as big an accomplishment as far as results go as Legatus, because, because of that multiplication factor. One member can do uh, just incredible things that they get turned on. Everybody has that potential, and particularly when you have the... Uh, experience and the talent that enables you to be a, a CEO. The world needs genuine witnesses to Christian ethics in the field of business. And the church asks you to fulfill this role publicly with courage and perseverance. This is the evangelical challenge that is being presented to you and I invoke upon you grace and peace in our Lord Jesus Christ.